We are on day six of our week at art school and today we'll be doing photography. And luckily for me, I have a substitute teacher in that knows a thing or two about photography. Let's go! For day six, we have five students left and whichever one of them graduates at the end of the week wins 10 grand. So I'm gonna call out your name, just say here and say anything you want to Jordan. Ryan. Here. My kids watch you and your daughter all the time. You've already moved on to the next round. Yes. <laughs> Savannah. You can just ask anybody in the wild to take photos with you. And you're gonna do that today. I do not have the balls for that. Michelle. I'm your biggest fan. I don't believe you. <laughs> and I bought you dinner last night, so remember that. Dinner. Shaq. I mean, I think we met before. I like the white afro that you got rocking right there, right there. Thank you so much. It's actually strawberry blonde, not white. Okay. You right? He you right? He's old, he's out. He's already cut, you can leave. Vanessa. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm super excited that you're here to help us out. Aw, that was so sweet. We will be taking photos of five different topics, and you guys will create a little portfolio, and you guys will be judged based on your five photos. The first topic we're gonna do today is nature. So Jordan, do you have any tips on nature photography? The biggest rule of thumb in photography is called the rule of thirds. Zach, will you help me out? So this is typical what you would do. So here are intersecting points. You put the subject on one of the intersecting points. How enthusiastic are you about this photo you're about to take? Uh, 10 out of 10. I don't believe you for a second. <laughs> I want to feel it. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's go. Let's go. I'm pumped. I'm ready to go. You will have 20 minutes, have fun, and good luck. Today will be a fun day. I love taking pictures. I love taking pictures of myself. Not really nature, but we'll see. Can I also tell you, when you're shooting with one hand, you're like, I'm so far, I'm a little concerned about her technique. Are you concerned about Michelle? Yeah, she's just going click, click. She misses the, I, I don't know. I, I, Michelle, uh, hold it with two hands. Oh, dude. But I have two cameras. So we only have 20 minutes, which is not that much time. So I'm going to be snapping away and definitely asking for Mr. Matter for his help. So I'm a real city boy, and usually what I like to see it on power lines a lot is the shoes kind of on power lines. So I'm going to do that same thing with my colorful shoes. Hopefully, I'll be able to get it back and I'll take a picture <laughs> of that. In college, I did take a photography class. It was an online class that I did. So I don't even know if I did it right. I got a passing score. Don't remember anything from it. So it's cool kind of learning a little bit about this and I'm ready to see if I can do some dope pictures. Okay, let's keep walking. There's a lot of bugs out here and I'm really afraid to walk through the grass. The grasshoppers are going to attack. I can feel it. So today's probably the hottest day this month. It's 108 degrees. It's like legitimately hard to think at how hot it is right now. Does that feel good? No. <laughs> that was a fail. It's really hot out here, but I've been focusing on bugs. I've gotten a few photos of grasshoppers and vultures and a really cool dragonfly. I've been wanting a cactus. I found a cactus. I'm kind of scared to walk through here, but I want to get this picture. I want to get this picture of this cactus. If I get bit and die, I love you guys. Back home, my kids, my wife. Ow, poke myself in the eye. So I got a lot of advice just because I feel like my, um, my pictures haven't been very good. Photography so far has been really hard. It's quite hard to find a good nature piece, that's for sure. Whew. So many dragonflies, I'm literally terrified. I'm okay, I think I have to go back for I'm ah! 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 What happened? So Why are you crying? A bug? It looked like something between a scorpion and a spider and a beetle. It bit you? Oh my goodness. Yeah! It did bite you. Oh what on earth? Taking a nature photo ever again. I thought today was gonna be a chill day. I thought I was just gonna relax. But instead, I cried my eyes out. This is torture. Art, art is not easy. Michelle. Yeah. First of all, I want you to know that if you die, I've uh -huh. really got life getting to know you. Thank I'm you. I'm sorry. <laughs> For lesson number two of photography, you guys will be doing speed portraits. Try not to do what everyone else would do. Be creative and try to add a little bit of humor. Make him do something silly. It's going to have a better chance of moving on. So for this round, you guys will go one at a time. You guys will be taking photos of me in this classroom. However you guys want, you guys can tell me to do anything. You guys have 60 seconds each. Yeah, shout out to Joel for helping me on this one. It's going to be tight. Hopefully I'll be able to redeem myself with this. Do you understand? What's happening? Yes, sir. You get one minute to get a photo one minute. of Zach. Got you. Ready? Yes. Get inside. Yeah, get inside. Get... Ew, there's coffee. <laughs> oh, right off the bat. More. I can't. My legs are stuck. Here we go. Wait, no, make him in there and then he's writing on the thing. Okay, then you write on the thing. I love yeah, it. from the trash. Using the trash. I need a marker. And stop. 
Hey, get right. sexy, my boy. I know what I'm gonna do, and I'm really excited. I want to call dibs on second. This is the only time I'm ever gonna volunteer because I'm so excited. I don't want anyone to take my idea. Over here. Yes, you're gonna be answering the phone. Oh, nice. 20 seconds left. Get him up here. Have him bend backwards and talk on the phone. Bend back. I can't. Bend. I'm not flexible. Back. Bend further. I did not think it was gonna be that hard. Don't take the picture till they're fully on his face. Put him against this. Look at the color. Come on, put him against this. You got 20 seconds. Open your mouth. Stick out your tongue. That's the shit. Ew. Ah. Uh, uh. Yeah. I can't believe Jordan Magic touched my tongue. Shout out to Ryan for helping me get those stickers on Zach's face. Appreciate you. I have immunity, so it doesn't really matter. And also, I'm going to save my best ideas for when it counts, which I don't think is this. Zach, make a weird face. Come on. How's it looking? It looks terrible. It looks really bad. Yeah, it, this would never win. You have a free pass. He's just messing around. Ryan doesn't even need the whole time. He's that good. <laughs> nice. Anyone wants to be a photographer, don't do it like anyone. So today we're going to go very sexy. So let's bring out your sexiest pose. Take off your shirt. Sexy, sexy, sexy like. Like sexy. I think this photo would be better if we did that. Is this what happens to models? For round number three, we will be doing selfies. Can I give you a little advice, Michelle? <laughs> Maybe not that. That looks exactly like every Instagram selfie I ever see. So we can go anywhere we want for the selfies, but the lighting is best in here. So I'm going to try some motion photography, I think. I'm going to get the Zach's play button and take a picture with it and get a shot of you looking at yourself with the mirrors and make sure you get a lot of mirrors in it. All right, so we're going up to the rappers because I have no good idea. And uh, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Interesting shot right there with the basketball. People are getting creative now. That looks like Zach's seat. Your son might have just lost you the next collaboration. <laughs> yeah, I want to keep collabing with him. <laughs> Nobody sits in Zach's seat, everybody knows that. Three, two, one. No more photos. So that sucked again. Uh, I had no good ideas, but I didn't take any good pictures. So uh, let's see what happens. I just jumped for five minutes straight. So I got one though. I got one. I don't know how that went. I just went a little cuckoo crazy and took some funny pictures. Took some selfies with people. I brought my inner demon for this third one. I bent backwards. I let my hair fly everywhere. I put the camera on the ground. <laughs> to get this perfect shot. This is gonna be the one. If you guys look behind you, there's a table full of plushies. Put a plushie out there sunbathing. You got sunscreen out there, you got sunglasses, right? That's the kind of photo I'm talking about. The plushie as a person will kill it. So Jordan's daughter, Salish, didn't come today. This one's for her. And you can also get your own at ZACstore.com. You guys should buy these. They're awesome and very snuggly. Money, whoa, where'd that come whoa. from? All of a sudden there's money. Yo, Ryan, watch out for the reflections, though. I can see some reflections of the light. But I want to get, like, a clean shot and none of it. You're being creative. I have nothing to say, but this is a good shot. Coffee would be. Wait, come here, come here. Like, you put him here, like that? That's funny. I can give him that, right? Because it doesn't matter. He goes on the next round anyway. Get get your qu shot quickly. Get this. You see, it's puddling all around. No, get further away. I can't help it. Can I take one? Yes, yes, I'm sorry, yes. I, can't, I, can't, I can't take it. This is my shot. This is my shot. This is on the discount rack. One of one. I'm gonna tell you, that's, that photo's not gonna win. I, w I wouldn't waste your time on that. Sometimes you're in a creative funk, but if you have one exceptional photo, you might end up getting through this round. So don't give up yet. There's still two left. They didn't come up yet. Oh, they didn't? No? None of, none of my shots did, dude. Content, right? All right, class, we are on to our final round, number five. For this round, you'll have 20 minutes, and you can use everything you learned from rounds number one through four. But remember, humor always works really well, creativity is great, and uh, some sort of interesting, unique concept that we haven't seen yet. All right, your 20 minutes have started. Remember, this is your last round, so if you think like you are not doing well, you're gonna wanna come up with something epic to give yourself a chance to win this. Keep in mind, you guys can stay here, you guys can go out, you guys can go anywhere you want. I think I'm gonna look at Jordan's page and get inspiration because I have no creativity whatsoever. That would be funny if we try to recreate some of his photos. Yeah, do you like wanna do it together? Yeah, okay. Okay, so Savannah and I decided to work together. We decided to be a team for this one and pose for each other because we got inspiration from Jordan Matters' page. What is happening here? Oh, yeah. Come on! That's what I'm talking about! Yeah! That was fun! Okay, so the last two photos, I think I did really, really well. Why is he tied with a rope? Wait, what, what is, is going on? Why is Ben shirtless for this whole scene? I love my job. <laughs> what do you think of everyone's photos so far that you've seen? I've seen a couple of really creative ones, and also some people feel like they're flailing. 
I already have an idea of a couple people who might go out. Okay, that was fun. I don't know exactly how well I did competition-wise, but it was a good time taking those pictures. <laughs> yeah, I love it. First of all, round of applause to all of you guys for getting through all five rounds. All right, now what you guys are gonna do, you guys took so many amazing photos, but you guys can only choose one from each category to present Jordan and I. I have to get second place or above to make it onto the next level. Not very possible. I'm not really sure what's gonna impress the judges, but we're all novice just trying to make it, so I'm just trying to put my bid in, it's all good. The last round was a lot of fun. I got to pour water on Ben and take pictures and had them like covered in rope. I feel great because I know I can't go home, so I kind of just had fun with this. I took a total of 126 photos today, and we can only choose one from each round. I have 346. That was standing a lot. I actually had a lot of fun. I had a super, 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 super fun uh, with the picture challenge. Uh, probably my second most favorite next to, obviously, the painting that I did right here. I love, absolutely love painting. We're gonna see how it goes. We shall see. Okay, so I picked my five images. I'm happy with how they came out, seeing them up on the computer bigger. I was like, wait, these are actually not too bad. Should I try to do some cool ones or should I just yeah. be stupid? Because it really doesn't matter. Let's start taking a look at Ryan. So this is his nature photo. That's a pretty standard to pour landscape photo. That's actually... I think that's a selfie. That's that's legitimately funny. And good lighting on him, actually. Good energy there. Mm. Look, I'm looking at you right now. You're about 100 times better looking than that photo. <laughs> That's pretty good. I would have liked to get him lower so you see more of the money, but I like the way it's blurred out. I would, that's his best photo by far. Do whatever you want. You have 20 minutes and that's what he did? Oh, dude, if, I wish I could cancel this guy. <laughs> Let's take a look at Shex. That's funny. How does his lip go sideways like that? Like, that needs some movement. This is whatever photo. He took a picture of one of our PAs. Don't you want to see more of the bike if he's going to do that? The path, which is the subject, is all the way over here. I really like that. That's a story. Okay, that's funny. He's got, he, yeah, he's got the plushie in the refrigerator. Plushies from ZHCstore.com. I'd buy one. Cute, you're in the garbage can. Pretty cute. I'd give that a six out of 10, that particular photo, but the other ones I really like. Next up we have Vanessa. That's so, pretty that's creative. Look at that. That's pretty creative. The split body like that. The main subject is this leaf, right? But it's off in the left, so it's the rule of thirds. That's actually pretty great, the Zach portrait. That's my favorite one yet. I was traumatized by that tongue sticker. Photo's a little blurry, isn't it? Blame it on the camera. That's a fun shot. I think oh. there's some good energy there. Okay, this is Michelle. Hey, that looks like one of your photos. Once again, that looks dangerous. I do not recommend trying to take these photos at home. You had the whole thing with the water and everything, and then she goes with that one. Okay. The angle might be a little weird. The tongue coming out, the head. That is such a cool photo. Let's be honest, all the nature photos, nobody really discovered the nature photos. Nature's hard. Finally, we have Savannah. Okay, that's the best nature picture by far. I don't know about that one. Very creative, backwards hat. That might be one of my favorite plushie shots. There's no good light, it's all backlit, but whenever you're doing a photo like that, you wanna make sure they get the hair off the face so you can see mm. the person's face. I believe this is a selfie, is of, her, of herself jumping, which could have been cool, except the hair. It took a while, um, this is a pretty tough decision, and Jordan, as the photography expert, yeah. he looked through all, he, he gave some insight, and uh, Jordan, you have your decision for today? I've made my decision. How do you feel? I don't, I don't like eliminating people, I just don't. You guys have been working hard for five straight days doing all kinds of art, and here I am, an outsider that has to eliminate two of you. All of you were so, so close to each other by a point or two, except one person who didn't try at all. I had really good score. So let's just get it over with. You got the worst score. You got a uh, 71 out of 100. Oh my God, I was expecting to get an F. So the two people that are moving on are Savannah and Michelle. Wow! Vanessa, you got an 83. And you see Michelle got an 84 and she was right next to you. And Shaq, you got an 81, which is so close. Savannah, you got an 89. That was the high score for the day. You had a couple of six shots. Congratulations, Thank Michelle. You. you got an 84. You just squeaked in. <laughs> Good luck. This is for you guys. It was such an honor to, to see you guys work and grow in this classroom. Do you guys have any final words for the audience? Unity, man, keep on creating. Thank you, Zach. This was just so much fun. I had like the best time ever, so. Thank you to everyone here. Round of applause for Shaq and Vanessa. Guys. You guys Good can work. head off. Ryan, 
You got lucky today. I saw some of those photos, Ryan. You didn't like the one of Vinny? Could you just show again his final photo? Like, what was that? Yeah, put it Did on the screen. Did you just go like second. walk and just go click as you walked away? I didn't make it through by one point, so it was super close. Bittersweet, but we got sweet. these though, so. Yeah, we got these. <laughs> All right. Well, with that being said, subscribe to see which one of them wins in the finale. We have one more day of art school tomorrow, and I will see you guys there. And obviously, a huge shout out to our substitute teacher, Jordan Matter. Thank you. Subscribe to his channel. Thank um, you. It's it's in the description. It's right up here. That's awesome. Thank you. Good luck yeah. in the finale. Thanks, Jordan. Take care. Keep watching. These guys are awesome.